Hello everybody, this is Boaz Fowler and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for August 9th, 2016. Today, Georgia tells me that uh, it's a great day for relationships. We have the Moon in Scorpio, conjunct Juno, sextile Venus, posing Sirius, trining Vesta. And that means that we can rekindle the fire in our relationships. We can put the passion and the spark back in those uh, good old relationships. What I do want you to be mindful of is that the moon is conjunct Lilith at the nighttime in Europe, that's uh, afternoon onwards in uh, the United States, and that's a time that we could be engaged in activity that's, uh, activities that are less positive or less productive for us. And these could be mainly in the realm of the psychological, emotional, or sexual realms. That means that we could be emotionally manipulative, that we could be either us or other people in our lives, right? Or we could be um, engaged in psychological, emotional, or sexual activities that are not really for our best interests. So just be mindful of that. Other than that, we felt like the heaviness and the frustration was lifted when Mars went out of retrograde a few weeks back. And we felt like things are finally moving forward again. But Mars is heading towards a conjunction with Saturn. And Mars is the planet of energy. It's the planet of forward movement. It's the planet of action. It's the planet of the, the forward moving poles. And the onward action. And it's meeting Saturn, which says, stop. Saturn that says, is that really how you should be doing it? Is it feasible? Is it the right way? Saturn, the judge, the tester, the lord of time, that holds everything and puts it under a test. And what that means is that A, we're going to have a lot of hard work on our shoulders during the next few weeks up to the end of August. And secondly, our actions are going to be judged. No bullshit. Just clear judgment. And that means that if we're not doing something right, if we're not going in the right direction, if we're not exact with how we should be doing things, we are going to see it very clearly in the next few weeks and we're going to be frustrated because it's going to be not it's not going to to be producing our anticipated results so really what we, we are going through is a realignment and in a way we are being thought how to act in the right way how to walk in the right direction how to hone our edge and cut like a, th like a sword through water. But the process itself could be hard work and it could be frustrating. <laughs> and it will only disappear and completely lift at the beginning of September. So, thank you for listening. On behalf of Georgia and myself, I hope you're going to have a very positive day. This is Boaz Fader. Goodbye.